so recently I was searching for a match and one of my dudes in my friends list was playing a storm. I tuned in for a show while queuing and observed some of the gameplay. And one particular move, a decision, caught my attention. Let's watch. Dire with the scan. Over here, you, you blew, blew it. it. Radiance Middle Tower is under attack. On a first quick look, you might think that this play was kind of not worth it, and you'd be right. But let's break it down further to truly grasp the potential benefits and negatives of such plays. Now, I'm not going to analyze the technical aspects of the pickoff itself. As far as I'm concerned, the execution was perfectly fine. I'm only going to dissect the choice itself. So, let's see what changed in the match status when the kill was performed. Positives? Storm gained about 250 gold and some experience. Silencer lost about 50 gold and was out of the map for 25 seconds. Tusk rotated bottom, leaving top more vulnerable. Now negatives. Storm has lost all mana. Enemy knows Storm's location and has the information that for a minute or two he'll be recovering and won't be a threat. Storm's farm slows down to a halt for a minute or two. Storm would have gained the same amount of farm by killing two jungle camps while not showing on the map and saving mana. Enemy cores continue to farm as if nothing happened. Silencer has to use his ult before, so for a few minutes he poses zero threat around the map. This kill makes no space. As we can see, the negatives far outweighed the positives, making this play a wrong one. What would be the correct play, you might ask? We have a couple options. Wait for the brew to respawn, go together to kill Spectre. Jungle around the area, waiting until Silencer goes out of the tower range to do other things. Clean kill with less mana wasted. Remain in base until either Walker or Doom shows, teleport and eliminate them. And so on and so on. This sort of breakdown is very useful if you're watching a replay and want to understand whether any particular play you made was beneficial or not. Usually, you could understand right away in a live match, as I'm sure this Storm player regretted this move afterwards. But breaking it down some more can reveal good viable alternatives, and you can even do the math on the differences in gold, XP and space for different player decisions. That is all. Good luck.